Hello guys, how are you doing? Welcome back to my channel. Where am I today? Somewhere I've wanted to go for years and years and years. I am in Broadchurch, AKA West Bay. Look at this, oh my, is that, is that a Dyson? <gasps> oh my God. Whoa, hello. This has honestly been one of my bucket list places for so long. Um, what's in here? So I'm staying in the Bridport Arms. Oh my God, this place is amazing. It's right on the sea. It's got like a downstairs place. This is just like, I, I, I want to say quintessential. Broadchurch is one of the most quintessential British TV drama thrillers ever and it's incredible. I'm Ever since I first watched it, I was like, oh my God, is this town real? And if it is, I need to come and visit. And it is, and I have. This is the bathroom, guys. It's like a proper seafood, um, it's a proper seaweed, it's a proper, what am I trying to say? It's a proper seaside town. And look, you'll be proud of me, I packed really lightly, just a bag with just a couple of change t-shirts. And then you come up these stairs, and um, we've got a lovely little view of the sea. Very lucky. And look, these are the cliffs I think you can walk up, oh my god. This place here looks so nice where I think I'm going to go and get some food like a wood fire uh, Pizza and lobster and the seas just there. Oh my god. I'm gonna be so happy here. And this is the bedroom upstairs This is amazing and <gasps> Oh my god What the hell <gasps> Oh my god That's so cool And then what we got here We've got tea, we've got a massive espresso thing, kettle. Surely there's not gonna be. Oh, there's water, there's milk. Oh my god. Wow. Oh my god, there's a chocolate chip biscuit. Oh my god, this is absolutely. Can I see the sea from my bed? I can. Oh my god, it's so good to be back solo traveling. I was gonna drive here, but I got the train, and you know what I'm like? I can't film that much when I'm traveling somewhere new because it's just, I. Yeah, I just feel, you know what I'm like by now. I just, I really, really overthink and like stress and I can't focus when I'm traveling somewhere new. So I tend not to film. Oh my God. So first of all, I'm gonna go for a toilet and then um, I'm gonna do some exploring. I hope you're doing really well, I missed you. I'm so excited. This is so cool. Can't believe it's got like a vanity mirror as well. That's very posh, isn't it? Bloody yeah, it's very Libra. It's very Mark Ferris, if you want me. This is so cool. They, they film Broadchurch here. I'm so excited to go explore. I definitely want to go to this cafe next door and get some food because I am starving. I had a really dodgy tummy on the way here because I ate something this morning I shouldn't have. Mixed with black coffee is never a good sign. <laughs> Welcome back, TMI as always. Thanks guys, nice to see ya. And yeah, I packed really, really light. So I'm only here until Friday. So I've got this t-shirt, tomorrow's t-shirt, Friday's t-shirt, fresh underwear, fresh socks, and I'm just gonna wear these joggers and these trainers. <laughs> Are you proud of me? And then obviously I've got my setting powder, and then I've got my, my toiletries. All right to hang there, yeah, it's nice and sturdy. And then that's it, and then I've got my tripod, my charger, oh, we're doing well, guys. We're doing really well, and I bought a book, just in case. Um, I wanna read, oh my God, it's so quiet here. Got my sunglasses, not gonna need them. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm absolutely starving. Got my tripod, what else do I need to take? Just charging. Oh my God, this is so nice. I faked out my face last night by just like spraying it and I just feel like it's a little bit dry. What was I going to say? Yeah, they use a uh, white company stuff here as well. Seashell these. Let's go get some food, have a little exploring and then just like a nice little catch up. It's only David Tennant. This is so cool. I wonder if it's because they, they filmed in this hotel. God, I just found my lip balm on the floor of the corridor. <laughs> God's sake. Wow. Ooh. 
Look how close. I am to the sea. West Bay Bridport Arms. And this is the hotel. It's called the Watch House. tomorrow guys we're in broad church and it's making me really emotional i kind of don't want to see it until tomorrow but yeah oh my god we've got the harbor over there i do want to see what this place is about so this is the front and then this is like the marina bit little gift shop we need to remember to get my little what's it called magnet they have been here. All the surfboards. Are they surfboards? No. Cute. I decided not to go in the watch calf. I'm just going to have a little bit, a little more of an explore, see what's going on. This looks nice. The George Riverside Terrace. See if that's open. You know what I'm like about birds, guys. There's a lot of them around here, I'll tell you that for free. There's actually an opportunity to do like, <laughs> hire a riverboat, but I don't think there's a river at the minute. This looks nice, doesn't it? Oh, this is lovely. I'm gonna eat in here, guys, I think. This is so nice. It's well nice in here. So I went for like, little nibbly bits. So I went for vegetable spring rolls, Korean wings, calamari, and skinny fries. Um, the food looks so good. Look at this, guys. Oh my god. Look at those spring rolls. Whoa. And the calamari. So good. I feel like the calamari is quite cheesy as well. I'm gonna go for. Sorry, you can't see me. Man, you could tell I was hungry. Oh my god, this food is so good. Might have to take these away. So guys, that place was called Rise and I honestly couldn't recommend it enough. Everyone in there is so sweet. Do I do it? Oh my God. You know how I love a boat trip. I don't feel like it's the right weather for this. So guys, over there, that round tower, I didn't even clock. That is the police station or that was the police station in Broadchurch. Um, the lovely girl in, the, in Rise told me about it, which is just over there. But yeah, now she said it, I was like, oh my god, of course it is. Oh, okay, maybe this. Canoe, no. This is the sort of place that I want to retire to, guys. What's this? Oh, look. If you haven't seen Broadchurch, it's like heavy themes. Um, like it's a thriller, don't forget. But Olivia Coleman alone and David Tennant, just the most amazing duo. It's the best TV show ever. There's like three seasons as well. I can only imagine how raging it is a summer as well. Like, I've got the boathouse over there, pizza box, like all the outdoor places. I can imagine it's so nice in the summer. Yeah, that's it. I don't know if it's a police station. I can't remember if I said police station or prison. But yeah, that's it here. Through there, through them steps. Oh my God. And I feel like they sat around here. Oh my God. Look like apartment buildings now. It's tiny in real life. Yeah, that's it, the police station. It's called Windy Corner Cafe. Cute. Wow. Oh, look. I'm just gonna walk to the edge of the pier. <laughs> The girl in Rise actually said that they've um, blocked off the walking bit up there because it's like f collapsing, which is terrifying. Um, so I might not be able to walk up that big one, but there are definitely other walks I can do. Oh my God, I can't wait. You know what I'm like on the first day? Get me bearings, get some food, get myself sorted, relax. I always feel like these little things look like little seal heads. <laughs> Like little seals, like popping out. Does that just me? Don't they? They look like little seal heads. <laughs> God, the seagulls are effing massive. <gasps> Whoa. 
This is unbelievable. I feel like it looks even better in like a misty day. to do my face tomorrow oh my god i love it here guys i just think i was destined to be by the sea oh god i ate way too much food Woo. oh my god that was honestly i'm not just saying this oh my god there are people walking up the hill oh my god are you joking nah i would go ass over tit over penis over tit over ass don't want to be putting myself in danger though so it's getting on guys, you know what I'm like, the first day of any solo travel, I like to get my bearings, I like to just really relax after travelling, don't know why, I don't know, I don't know, I find tra like travelling and moving around so, um, what's the word, I just, I don't know, you know when people like really properly document their travel days, I can't do that, I don't know why, I wish I could but I can't, it didn't get dark until like half eight last night, the sun was still out which was so lovely, I've um, got nothing in here. I'm gonna put the book that I'm not gonna read on my bedside. Or like peppermint tea and um, eat the cookie. Is everything all right? Oh, I need to voice note my friend back. Hello darling, just in broad church. How are you doing? Only thing I will say about this place is the Wi-Fi isn't that great and I'm not, oh my God, I'm not, um, slagging it off because this place is absolutely unbelievable it's got it reminds me of it smells like my nan's house it, maybe it's just like a type of wood that my nan had um but yeah the this place is amazing now i tell you what i prefer more than come dine with me it's four in a bed and there's back-to-back -back episodes on more four hold on i haven't actually checked but i wouldn't be surprised if they did it but your boy brings his own peppermint tea. <laughs> so yeah, this is my setting powder in a lunchbox. Oh my God, there is peppermint tea. What is this? I knew this place wouldn't let me down. What is this? Whole peppermint leaves. Eh? Oh my God, you put it in this. Okay, let's do that. I'm so confused. Here the hell's Joe's tea co? Joe Sarg. Oh, it's just a tea bag. <laughs> oh, alright. Lovely character. You know, like some hotels have really standard marks. This is like a character hotel. This is like a whole personality. Also, um, a lot of questions about my mouth in the last video. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you, I've got a tiny bit of Botox here. Um, to prevent pre to prevent it from like sagging, but it actually turned out to be the worst thing I ever did because I've had a dodgy smile for the past um, month and a half. No one's fault to be honest. It was just a place that I thought I needed it, but I don't, and I'm never ever gonna do it again. Don't let anyone tell you what you can and can't do with your body, but I'm telling you, do not get Botox under your mouth. <laughs> um, so thanks to everyone who pointed that out. <laughs> We're all friends here. We don't we don't keep secrets. Oh my god, this is just amazing. And then this, Moore's chocolate chip biscuits. Here we go. I actually don't mind the sound of the seagulls. I thought that would really scare me because they are next, they are bigger than me over here. And there's one staring right at me right now, <laughs> eyeing up my cooks. Um, no, that's mean. But yeah, I just want to let you know that I love you guys and I really appreciate and read every single message. And even if I feel like I've missed one, my mum reads them all and she relates back to me all the comments. Um, so yeah, I just feel very lucky that I can share myself all my quirky, deep, sad, up, dead, shake it all around sort of stuff with you. 
and I know you guys know how much I appreciate you and how much I love you and I don't know what I would do without you and your support. I wouldn't be here. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be here, I'll tell you that. But yeah, I watched Brokeback Mountain for the first time ever on last Friday. Um, and it's ruined me. I have been in a state of sadness ever since. It is one of the most beautiful films I've ever seen in my entire life. And I'd never seen it. I'd never seen Brokeback Mountain. There were reasons why I chose not to see it because I understood the premise. I knew it was going to be a sad film and I knew it was going to break my heart. And when I tell you, it did. And I, I feel like I was just ready for that on Friday. I don't know why. I've been going through some very, very similar things. And I thought, hmm, let me buy a book and let me watch Brokeback Mountain. Um, that's what I'm going to say about that. <laughs> if you've never watched it, oh my God, I, it's, it's literally been my personality for the past six days. Um, so yeah, if you haven't seen that, um, watch it. It's so good. Um, and that's about it really. <laughs> so let me know how you guys are doing. I've been waffling on for way too long. Um, but I just like to put in like little segments of me just catching up um, with you guys just to make sure you're right. Uh, yeah, this is so, this is so cozy. Say you love me but you never meant Nothing's real, no everyone's pretending And I could lie, I know you see it on my face It's the only one I can't forget Now I'm haunted by your silhouette Twenty balls, twenty cigarettes And I could cry but I don't have the time to wait So I lie alone and reminisce Nowadays I stand in clubs, I stand in bars I was only eyes the world go by You see my face, won't ever know my name Look at my 2016 hair. Ignore my legs, I haven't fake tanned them. Guys, it's like nine. And I'm in bed. Oh my god, this bed seems so comfortable. I need to fake tan my legs, I know. Oh my giddy arm. <laughs> I'm never gonna wake up. We've got modern family going on. We've got a peppermint tea. I can see the cliffs. I can sort of see the sea if I read something like that. I will see you in the morning, guys. Thanks for spending the first day with me. I slept so heavily, my dreams were insane. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel like I'm properly awake now. I honestly, that was the deepest sleep I have had in so long. Like when I woke up, I was like, where am I? It's just the sea air. Every single time I go near Brighton or wherever, wherever sea is involved. I sleep like an absolute mouse. Um, so breakfast first, we're gonna go to Cherries, um, which is a two minute walk away. This, like, this place is just amazing. And then I wanna go on a big fat walk. And then I've spoken to my friend and she sold me to go into Bridport Town, which is like a 40 minute walk, which is perfect. So obviously I didn't drive. Um, yeah, oh my God, the dreams I had last night. I had about four different intense dreams and in every single one I got mugged off. Um, but what are you going to do, eh? I just, yeah, I love it here. I can't even begin to imagine what it's like in the summer. One of the t-shirts that I bought um, has a massive permanent stain on it, which I didn't realise. And it says, like, love everyone. And there's a big stain here. And it's not even, like, a cool stain. It's just, like, a mm, quite messy stain. Um, and I just don't want to be, like, you know. Oh, fuck. And then, yeah, I think I'm going to go to the watch house for either lunch or dinner because the wood-fired pizza, lobster, and crab just sounds amazing. God, guys, it's there. There's my hotel, and there's cherries. I've been walking around. I didn't know it was this close. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, cute. Look at the little Christmas lights. Oh my God. This is so nice, guys. Good morning. Good morning. Just uploading my Instagram story. Make sure to follow me on Instagram if you're not. And I think 
whilst I'm here, I'm gonna get my magnet and then go on a big old walk. Okay, we've got Sammy's. Oh no, Sammy G's. What have we got down here? God, I didn't wear the right shoes again. Custom house cafe open. Oh, this looks cool down there. Tiki bar. Oh my God. Love him. Oh, look at them. Oh my God. Oh, I'm gonna have to get the rainbow one. Oh no, I quite like the crab. Gonna get the bejazzled ice cream, I think. Oh, this is my dream. Oh my God. God, imagine this in the summer. Oh my God, I love it. What is it like? It's my little room up there. God, it takes up the whole floor. And then around here, and this is where I feel like I wanna go for dinner or like a late lunch. Got my magnet. I feel like this is where they sat when they had ice cream, but there's a big mound here now. It's either these ones or these ones down here. Again, not the right shoes, but because they're platformed, I'm not exactly going into the sand that much. Um, so yeah, let's go for a big old walk. Because sometimes I have to change the sun party. Then I wake up And I'm alone again On my own I'm living lonely Like nobody even knows me Then I wake up And do it all again mm -mm. I sometimes have to change The sun party really hurts me Then I wake up And I'm alone Imagine me in the love of my life, or me, just me on my own. Retiring here, beach parties, oh. God. Oh no. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> Not the right shoes, Mark. Will you never learn? There we go. Moo moos. Hello. Jesus. Man alive, look at my hair. I look like a absolute swollen, sniffy, crusty ball bag. Um, whew. I am gonna have a shower. I'm gonna get myself sorted out again. Oh my God, she cleaned the room. I feel so bad because I left it in such a mess. I am knackered. I've done 10K steps already, but yeah, I need a shower. Oh my God, this is amazing. It's all fully stocked. I went downstairs and I was like, can I pay for more pods? And it's all stocked. Oh my god, that's so cool. And I think that this is all that's all free. Oh, that's my my die. Yay! Right, guys, I have I've been watching some come dine with me whilst I've been editing some content for Instagram. I've already done ten and a half thousand steps, which is I think is really good. 
E. This was the t-shirt. Look, there's fake tan stains all over it. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go to the watch house now um, for some pizza because I am really, really hungry. But now I feel really good. I feel great that I've done like 10 and a half thousand steps already. And it's not even 2 p.m. So I'm gonna hide all that fake tan stain. I'm gonna take my headphones just in case. I'm really good at just like not having my headphones in um, whilst I dine alone. But it, it, I've, I've done that. I've proved that I don't have to have it, but I just like it. And if you like something, God, enjoy it, eh? God absolutely obsessed with this fragrance. It's the Maison Margulies, no, Maison Margulies replica, Lazy Sunday morning. Woo! Hashtag gifted from Space NK, thank you so much. This all looks very good. I never really drink cider, but this tastes really good. Oh dear. So these are the pork bites and chorizo. This is the tiger prawn pizza, Jesus. Oh my God, I put the chorizo on the pizza, it's so good, guys. There's just so many places to go. I just got another t-shirt from Bayside um, because I've spilled pizza all down my hoodie and t-shirt and I look like a mess. And then there's a shop over there, a sweet shop called Bon Bon that's only been open for like four weeks. And I got some fizzy sweets, yay. So yeah, I'm gonna do some more exploring now. I love it, there's just so many options. Oh no! Oh my god, there's stones. I've split my converse. There's a big stone in that. No wonder I've got like pain in my foot. Just saw a house for sale. I'm gonna buy it. Relocate. Get out of South London. Start a new life. I don't need some man who doesn't know what he wants. Back in South London. No, we don't. Okay, so this is a new t-shirt. It's called Weird Fish. It's from a shop called Weird Fish, which if I was a shop, I'd probably be called Weird Fish. I just, yeah, you know what I'm like, I just can't be walking around. I've got to be repping London, and I? I can't be walking around with pizza stains all down me. I just feel like a new lease of life. I'm really energized, uh, energized, motivated. I feel happier here. Now, don't get me wrong, I am happy in London, but you just get so swept up with things that are not necessarily that important. Like, I'm not, I don't, I don't want to be like, sad about, re like, and I know everything's relative, but I don't want to, like, be sad about things that I know I shouldn't be. Oh, yeah. Sour blue raspberries. Mmm. And, like, when I travel away, it's like, there are so many more people and opportunities. There's so much more to, like, the world than the situation that isn't even that a big deal that I'm going through at home, do you know what I mean? Even though it's all relative. What's in the name of the shop? Go check it out. The man was really sweet in there. Sweet, get it, Pat. Guys, I feel like the sun's coming out a little bit. It's windy though. Absolutely magical guys, absolutely magical. Found someone's tea bag over there as well, taking a leaf out of my book. God, I think the signals, the seagulls are signaling. Um, this is an orange chocolate chip. Oh my god, I'm actually scared to eat this out and about, so I might go and eat it in my room. <laughs> Them seagulls are beckoning their friends over to come mug me. Oh my god, incredible. Do not trust the goals <laughs> one bit. 
Mint chocolate chip is my favorite flavor, but orange chocolate chip, whoa. <laughs> I'm four in a bed is on. What a time to be alive, eh? Gonna enjoy a peppermint tea. It just looks like it's starting to rain, actually. Gonna do some editing, just chill for a bit. I've done 16,000 steps today. Please edit that. Guys, the sun is out. I'm so glad I got to witness it in the sunshine. Absolutely love it here. This has been one of the most amazing, short but very sweet trips. I'm so glad I got to see it in the sunshine. Oh, it's so friendly here. It's clean. I feel so safe. This is definitely a place where I feel like if I ever just need to get away. Morning, guys. I'm not okay. I don't want to leave. <laughs> I'm usually the first person to say that. I'm ready to go home. I'm ready for my hometown. I, there's something about this place that every single person that has said the same thing. It's just pure peace magic here. I would definitely stay in this hotel again. And the fact that they restock all your stuff. Oh my god. I've just loved every single minute. Three hours to get here from my ends. And um, yeah, I'm gonna go into Central Bridport before I head on home. <laughs> but then I need to remind myself, I'm very lucky I'm doing this during the week. Um, I feel really grateful. Obviously you guys know that. Bye room. Thanks for having me. <laughs> oh God. Bridport arms guys, get on it. Half hour walk to Bridport. Yeah, that's nothing. Guys, what do we think? Oh, it's out of focus. The new living room area. Dining room table is over there now. And what do we think? Oh my God. Someone on Instagram said this reminds them of Central Perk. And honestly, I've never felt so more content with like anything in my house ever. But yeah, how do you feel? Do you like it? I really hope you've enjoyed this vlog. Um, it's been one of my favorite places I've ever visited, visited to. Um, I love you guys so much. I'm always here for you, regardless of what you're going through. I hope this, however long this vlog is, um, made you just take a deep breath. We're all going through our things. And uh, until the next vlog, which I think you're gonna really love because it features someone very special who hasn't been on this channel for a while. I give you two guesses. Starts with Z, ends with U. I love you guys, and I will see you very soon. Goodbye. Uh,